Mike, we're here with Milo Sarchev. What are your thoughts on the men's open? Well, my thoughts, I'm super happy for Hadi. You know, for me, Hadi could have uh, two titles already. Yes. Uh, 2019, uh, so uh, it couldn't happen to the more deserving guy. Uh, he was the best package, best condition, nothing missing. You know, so uh, uh, my hat's off to him. So uh, I'm very happy with this. Second, uh, Derek was surprised, of course. Uh, I said in a podcast about a month ago when they asked me, can he possibly win? I said, of course he can win. Right. You know, it's just if they're going to look for the shape. The taper that he has, front of legs, front of biceps, back of biceps, is uh, very much untouchable. But, but he had uh, uh, still softness to his chest, shoulders, arms, and uh, abs. If you look at, I mean, anybody that's going to analyze, you analyze. You look, there's not the same conditioning from the front or from the back. Uh, third was, uh, who was that? Nick. You know, if you ask me, there's no way that Nick should beat Samson. Yeah. You know, in, a, in any shape or form, in bodybuilding, you know, you look for the best body, for the best shape, for a total package. So for me, of course, I would be biased. But uh, yeah, this is how I, I look at it. Samson could be battling for that uh, third place. Well, actually, even second, you know, because uh, setting him next to uh, Derek and go pose by pose, there's going to be many reasons that he could have won. And then uh, Brandon Curry was not as his best. I mean, he, he's never sharp, especially he wasn't sharp now. Again, I encourage you to look at his posing routine in the afternoon. You couldn't find a, a separation on his quads if you, you know, try to. You know, so that's not Olympia conditioning. Beautiful body. He improved the legs. Uh, I, I criticize him for legs. He improved, but he's still not balanced out with the upper body. Then finally, Rami, I mean, uh, nobody expected that he's going to be pushed so much down. You know, uh, it's kind of a surprise. There you are. There you are. <laughs> okay. Oh, here it is, Mr. Olympia. <laughs> hey. So anyway, that's it. Are we doing a, you know, wrap-up soon? <laughs> anyway, so that's it. And then... Uh, yeah, six for Samson. We are very, very happy. Yeah. First Olympia to go in the first uh, call out and top six. That's what people forget is like, this is Samson's first Olympia. So. Yeah, that's first Olympia. And uh, a lot of experts that know about the bodybuilding see him as a future threat yes. because his combination of everything size, shape, thickness, width, crazy presentation, and uh, you know, so he has a yeah, win in his wings now. Yeah. Yeah. I saw him zoom by, but uh, I really appreciate you. Yeah. Uh, Samir Badoon, legend. See, how are you? You can ask I'm him amazing. for opinion. How are you, how are you doing? Uh, I'm good. What I'm, ha I'm happy open? to see my good old buddy Milo. Yeah. So, <laughs> the most passionate man in bodybuilding. Maybe yeah. after me. Maybe one, <laughs> no, <laughs> after maybe you. one of the most hopeful. Well. <laughs> I'll give it to you. Yeah, yeah no. Milo and I are passionate. Yes. We just love the game. Yeah. And you're not you afraid know. to speak your mind. Do I, I'm always speak my mind. Okay. Yeah. Really? But you know, you Here's an apple and I'm already. Right here. There you are. Great, always great, great, great job. Oh my oh, god. Yeah. How are you, Habibi? Good to see you too. Thank you. Thank you. We're going to the party. You're going to the party. I'll see you there. Are you going to be at the party? Okay. okay. Yes. I'll see you there now. All right. So anyway. Amazing. You're going to uh, ask him for the opinion, but uh, who else? Uh, Andrew Jack. Wow, best Future. posing I think. You think he's best posing? The whole crowd popped. In the standing ovation on the way out as he was walking out. Really? I think the crowd liked it. It might not have been the most ah, I don't know. You know. I still think that uh, there's a lot of us. He's not quite, but we talk about Andrew Jack. Andrew Jack has a oh, yeah. phenomenal structure, uh, physique and all that stuff, but his posing is still uh, oh, He's agree. amazing, he's yes. amazing. He's huge, incomplete. Yeah. What somebody told me he had a bronchitis or something. Is that true? Oh, I don't know. Uh, yeah. So, so he could have been in better shape. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Hunter Labrada, yeah. Uh, yeah, it's I'm sure disappointing for him. He didn't deliver again. I mean, uh, he has all the tools, but he just needs to be like his father. You competed little, like his little father. A little bit more edge. He yeah. needs to be a little more edge. See, that, that's what I said. His father was never out of condition on yeah, the stage. Yeah, never. Yeah. That's true. And I, and I wish that he helps him. He you, you know what? One guy I want to talk about, Grizzle. 
think this guy have a great, great potential, but he's not in control. He need to have a more control. His stand sucks. Yeah. And he needs to be still sharper yet. Yeah, so You're working with him now, aren't you? No, no, no. no, no. Oh, okay. I, I wish I did. What do you think? I think it's a monster. I Potential him wise. Yeah. The best uh, frontal biceps you've uh, he's, he's not missing seen. much. I mean, yeah. diamond calves, good flow. Yeah, the thick, uh, muscular, fibrotic chest, shoulders, arms. Yeah, yeah. yeah. He needs a bigger back to sell. Yeah, yeah, back, yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah. know, uh, to be polished. Yeah. But, I gotta go because uh, you don't do that. Yeah, you're welcome. Yeah. Hey, Lewis, good to yeah, see, good to see you. See you. That's it, ladies and gentlemen. Please like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you in another episode.